Just grabbing the boat, got the bikes in the back. Just a couple a more things to do. Lucky. You're and then we're lucky gone. I have a I have a screen cover on my phone. Okay, ready? Okay. Now Brett's gonna hand the bike over top here. Perfect, we got her. I'm gonna sit here, Brett's gonna sit there, okay. or vice versa. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, that That's what we need, Brett. Can you go and grab a blanket in the back seat? I think I just threw all the blankets in there.
What do you see? This is like harder or easier than the cap chief coming up the... I think easier is just steady and straight. Like, oh, yeah. Ours is like this fucking rocky shit. Yeah, and then well, there's a bunch of kind of flat spots, but... It's definitely not as long. I don't think so. I think we'd already be at time warp if we were riding this far. Especially from the house, if the house was the boat. Yeah, this is like, we're about six kilometers in so far. I so want an e-bike. Yeah, you'd love an e-bike. I'd do laps. Yeah, you'd do laps I'd with do us. Labs. I'd do laps too. That'd be so fun. It's gonna be fun, we'll have our e -bike Yeah, too. I know, that's one of the goals I want. I, I want us all to get e-bikes so that we can do that. We'd just be cruising. So cruising. But for now, we get to take breaks. <laughs> Lots and lots of breaks. Fuck yeah. <laughs> yeah. In my head, when I'm doing the hills, I'm like, I'm draining in my head. Okay. Yeah. I know, I feel like day four or whatever this yes, is. It hurts. Yeah. It hurts. Today would have been like a break day for me, I think. But it's just too good. We got to do it. And we've been doing it enough that, you know, pushing through a break day actually isn't so bad so far. Yeah. Yeah. And then that last little bit when you're like, oh no, I'm done. <laughs> Maybe get some food in us. <laughs> Eat a snack at the cliff trail at the top there. That's a cliff. Cool. There's Denman and the Vancouver Island. Hey guys, look at this. Look at this. I'm getting vertigo. Woo! Yeah, that's crazy. This is so cool. That is like a very, very, very vertical cliff right there. And it's all like this crumbly conglomerate sandstone. I'm saying it's so sketchy, but this feels amazing. Holy. Yeah, I don't like heights either. Wow. That's just sick though. All right. Time to go back. Oh, it's so amazing. But sketchy. It feels like this whole thing is just going to peel away. Well, yeah, on the backside. And it's all just this like really loose rock. Oh my God. Obviously it's been here for a while. Yeah, right? But uh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, Brett, we just need to put you on a strap and then, then if you go, we'll hold on. Put an anchor behind a tree or something. Okay, whoo. That's so cool. That is amazing, dude.
Ah, oh, yeah, Mr. Toad's racetrack from Mario. Like everywhere, a nice little up to start your journey. That looks, that's intense, a little step down drop I'm not doing. That one might be doable. You're right. <laughs> no way. Wow, that's pretty crazy. Yeah, I'm almost doing that one. Not really, though. Yeah. Not really. Yeah. Look at the tree and the run out. Oh, yeah. What's that? So cool. This one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you want to hit that one. No? Oh, oh that's that one bad. looks fun. But it's like a little, it's like a double. Yeah. I'm just not doing it. Buddy. Oh, no thank you. That's a little too high, even coming up that sketchy. Holy. Look how dumb that is. That's I didn't see it like that. That one just sticks right up. Look at it. It's like a hump. Oh yeah, it's it's a step up. You're supposed to launch off of that. No thank you. I ain't at that level, but this is like the mini whale tail from from Joyride and stuff. <laughs> that ain't my cup of tea, man. You never get better if you don't try, but I play in play within my limit. <laughs> Next one. Oh wow, that's so cool. Big drop though. Oh, no. Yeah, I saw you moved it. There we go. Now we're back on. This is cold split. Is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Is this the right way? Yeah. Yeah. 
So there's not much in the way of consistent downhill here. Maybe something like that, uh, the top black diamond into purgatory <laughs> is probably the closest you can get. Yeah, for like a full on, like anything on Texada uh, has a lot of those up and downs, you know? So it's, it is a lot like this, except for the steep stuff we have is like longer and is, yeah. it's steeper. Everywhere you go, the giants are gone. All there's left is what they've left. The young ones. The young ones, all right, for the picking now, I see, yeah? I'm gonna take them all, strip it bare, leave nothing left, not a drop of water in the forest, just dust and non-merchantable timber. What's that? Oh, look at that little bear den. Another giant they cut all of them look at that one that one was gone that one's gone oh well that's why we fight for what's left stop old growth cutting in british columbia paul stamets says it doesn't make sense anymore so does, brett so does brett maverick and justin liebich all right, still a little bit to bitch and Camaro, but. That's why it's called bitch and Camaro, because you're bitching right the You're bitching? You wish you had a Camaro to just rip up this road on? Ah, oh, drop your bikes off. Yeah, I've seen a bunch of them. There's an old stump right there. Yeah, I don't have first gear. If I do this a little bit and hold that uh, down, then it seems to push it over enough it doesn't skip. So it's just an adjustment. Look at that big one. Big old cedar. Oh, the Shrek. Yeah, there's another some. Another some. But when they came to cut the first time, there probably wasn't many trees smaller than that. Just a big forest. Of, look at those big stumps just cut down there too. Save old gold forest people. Oh, at least what's left. What's whatever's near you. This is it. That looks good. Bitch and Camaro. Look at that.
honey. Happy anniversary. Hey, yeah. This is our rip. This is our Vlog anniversary. Vlogging railway we're on. Vlogging railway anniversary. But we we boated to a sand sandy beach. You swam from the boat. We've been in this beautiful forest all day. Now we get to go and have refreshments and another boat ride. Ooh la la. Why? Where are you going? Did you turn off of it? Well, you're on. I don't know. I don't know where you are. Let's see. Oh. Cool, where are you now? Okay. There's an eight meter climb somewhere and then we should be all going all downhill. So I looked on the map and I watched our little GPS marker move and it slowly started creeping up Walton instead of French Connection. That's the only reason why I know. No signs, just forest. But this should, this should be downhill to the parking lot. Send it to the parking lot. Big sends, buddy. Big, big sends, brah. Sends me. Sends me, brah. Park a lot. Nice, Tara. That was fun. Yeah. More fun. That's a beautiful trail. That looks pretty new. This way. Yes. Playground zone. Yeah. Dust to dawn. Every day we're around. Bike trails, bike trails, bike trails.
Yeah, we could pull the boat in and come to the beach. Like, look at where that guy's parked. We could just beach the boat. That's what I was thinking. Oh! And then, like, load up. Yeah, load up, have everything go, ready to go. I mean, like, seriously. Ah, it's pretty sweet. There's a lot of sand. So many people here. And they're spread out reasonably well with all the places to go. <laughs> unicorn floaty, obligatory unicorn floaty. All right, it will come up pretty quick to here anyway. So this will give us like 20 minutes, maybe half an hour.